Joey and Missy are part of the furry fandom, a global community who love to release their wild side by dressing up in their own animal fursonas. My fursona's name is Riot. He's a very confident and somewhat flirtatious fox. I actually have two personas. One persona's name is Pix, and she's a very bubbly and spunky Siberian husky. And I'm the most adorable husky you ever want to see. My second persona is Freya, and she's a Shiba Inu deer hybrid, and she's very sassy. Joey first embraced the furry lifestyle when he started college. I found the community to be welcoming when I was going off to college and on my own for the first time. I wasn't super into like sports or anything like that, so I was always more the computer kid. So I was a little on the, I guess, weird side, but it really helped me come out of my shell. For Missy, becoming a furry happened when she was in need of some comfort. I lost my grandfather and I didn't know how to deal with my emotions. I, I felt like I just had no outlet. A friend of mine said, come out to this meet with me, you know, meet a bunch of furries. I sat there and I thought maybe I could give this a try. For me, each time I put on my fursuit, it makes me feel not so bad on those days where it's hard to cope. But what do their families think about their fursonas? They literally said, seriously, you're a grown woman and you're wearing an animal costume, stop it. And the more I explained it, the more it made sense. Both of our parents don't really get it, but it's just more of a, if it makes you happy type of thing. First suited up and now players in the scene, it was almost inevitable their furry paths would cross. I met Missy in a, a group text chat for a bunch of furries. We started talking, and then we eventually agreed to meet at a convention. He tried so hard to just win me over, and it didn't work, so we ended up fighting. I felt really bad, and I called him up. They said, you know, I'm really sorry, but if you want to give it a second chance, I'm, I'm game. And I agreed. Once they'd patched things up, Missy and Joey unleashed their furry fetish in the bedroom. There are times when both of us enjoy engaging in somewhat frisky activities while we're wearing our suits. Something that a very small subgroup of furries are into, and we happen to be part of that small subgroup. I was curious about the sexual aspect, to be honest, and it felt kind of rebellious because it goes against everyone's view of a furry. To participate in these pursuits, their first suits must be fit for purpose. One of my suits has a hidden crotch zipper for those type of activities, so it is, it's very discreet. It's hidden in the front and then you just unzip it and there you go. When I designed my suit, I specifically asked my fursuit maker if they could put in a strategically placed hole. Yeah, just, there you go. That's what it is. 